Hi, my name is David. I'm a co-play frontier from the Genesis Group. Just want to give you guys a market update. I'm going to try to make it quick. So let's look at Bitcoin. Let's look at it from the weekly. Uh, for Bitcoin to show strength, you see that pink line? It needs to print above the pink line. And it's pretty much right at the pink line, right? So we look at it. You know, it's like 27800 80 something dollars or almost 90 something maybe 90 some dollar and you can see bitcoin for this week went already down to 27,000 it went all the way up to 28,000 but you can see this thing is resistance you know it was resistance it was resistance the week before it was resistance on this on on this candle here and so right now i still think bitcoin is you know it's not secure yet yeah, it's still not safe. Uh, I did say in the previous, last week, I did see that Bitcoin has, you know, momentum going up. At least on the daily, but still, um, no, I, I don't think Bitcoin has broken out. Like, I, I, you know, obviously it's still in phase one of the bull run, okay? But, you know, the pullback from phase one of the bull run. Uh, you know, I, I don't, I wouldn't say it's over. So let's look at uh, CoCoin. So I still think Bitcoin could get dragged down to 20,000, maybe lower. Rather, it takes weeks or months. But that being the case, you know, if Bitcoin gets dragged, CoCoin's going to get dragged. Now, CoCoin has this nice little channel. CoCoin has this nice little channel going up, you know, is it's, it's good. Uh, it is showing, you know, like a rounding, it's, it's rounding, so, you know, it's like that, and then hopefully it can round up, so what you want is like that, and then slowly round up, but the problem is, is Bitcoin drops, if Bitcoin, you know, if it drops, you know, down to the 20,000 range, here, you know, it's going to slam down CoCoin. Uh, you know, I mean, yeah. Now, you know, I was even thinking about like a, a weekly head and shoulders type of deal going on. That could be a powerful beat down on Bitcoin if something like that plays out on a weekly chart. Um, and so that's it right now. Uh, I'm not in the camp that you know this pullback from phase of phase one of the bull run right here. This phase one right here. This is phase one of the bull run. I still think you know we could still have we could still go down more. Yeah, I don't think it's over yet. Uh, so that's just my opinion. Remember, I'm not your financial advice. I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just telling you what I think will happen or what I'm doing and I give you all reasons why um, I'm still m more than half of my holdings is just in Bitcoin and Ethereum most of my holdings more than half more than half not most well no it is more than 50 percent you know sorry so you know um, I do still have some alts I do I still have some UVXY um, I still have some tether, you know, just being, just being safe on all of it. Cause if Bitcoin goes down to 20,000 or it goes down more, you know, maybe I'll buy in some Bitcoin or depending on how badly the alts are beaten down, maybe I'll get into some alts. Um, and that's what I'm waiting on. So yeah, there you have it. Uh, as always, you know, please take care of yourself spiritually mentally physically okay surround yourself with the right people you know now's a great time to to get to know god to accept jesus as your lord and savior the world is just getting seems like it's getting crazier it's getting worse society in the western world is just getting worse it's, it's crazy in my opinion so yeah uh you want to surround yourself with the right people so i gotta say you know i think uh right now um, 
it looked like Ja, ja market is looking better than expected and so maybe next month or in december you might even see another rise another raise in uh, the federal interest rates the fed rates probably will go up if you know and that's going to hurt the market so that's why you see the u.s dollar just taking off and looking so strong and so yeah there y'all have it uh but, you know, eventually it's going to hit the job market, you know. So that's why, I, like, I work hard. I recommend you work hard. And, you know, inflation sucks. So to be honest, I just think the economy will continue to get worse. And I, I think, like, over two years ago when I said economy will get worse, some people thought I was nuts. But I was, uh, two years ago I said the economy will, you know, hit a downturn. And maybe some people thought I was nuts, but I was right. And I still been saying it even till now, the economy will continue to get worse and it still continues to get worse. <laughs> so, you know, yeah. But anyway, I'm praying for all of you. God bless all of you in Jesus' name. Um, and Coco.